Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, we're back with another video. And, uh, we're gonna do baked chicken. Whole baked chicken. It's like my glasses lean or something. I slept on it last night, so it's probably. I don't know. And I fell asleep in my glasses, so it's so yeah. So I'm gonna do a big chicken, but I need your help with something. So let me put you guys down right here. Alright, don't mind my old clothes, then. I'm gonna have them on my yard. Don't mind my clothes. Which is the smallest one? This baby right here? Or. Or. Or this baby. This look fat alone. Comment below if y'all think the first one is smaller or this one. But I think this, the first one is smaller. So we're gonna go with this baby right here. We're gonna defrost this baby. Yes. I'm going to show y'all the whole nine yard how to clean it up. No, no, no. Yes, y'all can clean it up. Oh, clean that baby up. Guys, first I was going to do these babies right here. That I took out to put the tar to cook. Um... So I'm just gonna season it and pop it right back in the freezer. Since I'm doing a whole chicken, I'm just gonna season this and put it back in the freezer. Cause I don't know when I probably cook it. Not tomorrow, cause basically meat. It's a whole chicken I'm doing today, so that probably serve for tomorrow also. Not probably, yeah, tomorrow also. If you're gonna me. So, I'm gonna put it in a cover dish. So guys, what I'm doing now is I'm washing some calories. To steam it. I think I should use all of this color room. Let me put the rest of it in it. I'm gonna use the color loop to stuff the chicken so I'm not gonna add any onion to the I don't know any onion, skillet, or tomato or anything like that. Just gonna put a little pinch of salt. Some seasoning. A little onion powder could do too. And that should do it. A little spicy. Yep, and that should do it. I'm gonna tip a little oil in it. Tip some oil in it. Oops. And a little piece of butter. Some butter here. It's about the year. So guys, we're on to the cleaning up of the chicken. Want me you want some tea? Want more tea, baby? Alright, this is gonna have to wait, guys. I think my baby is hungry. So I'm gonna get back to this. I'm 
to get back to this, guys. Come to my miserable baby. I'm going to flash to make my color look ugly. But anyway, guys, there you go. Finish your job. You don't have to steam it extremely soft because it's going to go in the chicken and in the oven. So it actually will finish cooking in the chicken. So this is good. Turn it off. Okay, so back. And that took the, 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 the color go off the stove, as you all see earlier. No need to steam it soft. Yeah. Just do it just right and take it off because it's gonna finish cook either way while it's in the oven. So I pop it in the freezer to cool down a little. Even though that's not necessary to just put it in the chicken, not like that, but hey. I'm doing this. You know, I really shouldn't put it in the freezer, but you know. Girl just crazy sometimes. And guys, not because I want all the chicken on our cook. Mean tell the chicken of a screen up. Clean up the meat. Clean it up. Clean it up. Take off the extra fat and then something down unnecessary, you know what I mean? Get rid of them, baby. Get rid of them. As long as you can reach them and get rid of them. Now we're gonna go inside here and get out this bad boys you see them all of these must lift up and come right out you see so you put your knife or in hand or whatever and get out this baby yeah y'all can see me y'all can see me y'all can see me y'all can y'all can y'all can see, see me guys the bad boys you're supposed to come out just know that so I'm not clean up on me. I need a smaller knife. It's right here. That knife too big for this. Yeah. Yeah, bad boy. Just like that. So guys, the only reason we're not gonna cut off this right here is because we're gonna use it to hold the legs together. I'm gonna pop it in the oven, yes. You all will see what I'm talking about. Y'all will see what I'm talking about. Y'all will see what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Chicken to clean. Do you want to see it, baby? I'm going to see it. My mom will come put you down on the drop of sleep. Mommy, I do something right now. Mommy can't attend to baby. Alright? But it's okay. When you drop a seat, mommy put down baby, right? Right. Good boy. Good boy. Such a good boy. Guys, my baby's racking himself to sleep, so I'll have to put him down whenever he's out. Alright. So that's what it looks like after you dig it up and take out all of them, isn't it? Now you're going to wash your baby out. And your chicken is clean. And as I said before, this is going to go over this. You understand? So it's gonna look like that when you're done with it. Chocolate. You see? That's why we're not cutting off this. 
<laughs> that's the reason why we're not cutting it off. We're not cutting it off. We're not cutting it off. Alright. And guys, remember, wash your meat with vinegar. Or lime, whichever one you have. Guys, I'll go back and I'll put on my baby. So guys, if you wash as you go along, you find extra fat, you clean them out, alright? Look them out. Anywhere you find fat, things we normally clean off your chicken, you clean them off. As long as you can reach them, you clean them off. See? You clean it up. Clean it up, clean it up, clean it up, clean it up. Now we're talking. Now we are talking. Guys, and if you want to strip the skin from your meat, it's your choice. Do whatever you want. Do it to please you. Because you're going to eat it, right? If you cook it to your likings, here it is. I mean, yep. Sexy baby, don't want to show sex, you know? <laughs> Boy, no, we gotta stab her. Stop, 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 stab her. You do this in the season, my mates. Worse, you just have a season it and just pop it in the oven. Set speed. Oh guys, yeah, your oven should be preheating at this time. Even though I'm gonna light mine, but I'm gonna light it now. When you do this, the season will go everywhere. All over. I mean, everywhere. All over, good guys. seasons or this as you all know and some garlic onion and garlic I'm not putting any country pepper in it reason being it burns my finger so as I said we're gonna use the nutri bullet Sometimes this blasted thing. Oh, I'm gonna add a little water. Just a little bit. Oops, that's too much but chili. Okay. Okay. What else I'm missing? Now I'm missing this skeleton time. I mean garlic. That should be it. Let's just pop. One of these bad boys right in there. Yes, what I'm doing. 
That's a green, nice little color. Nice little green color. What about this color here? Alright. 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 Or, y'all are gonna wanna see me do this on the cutting board to put team this. Anyways, I don't know how I'm gonna show you guys, but I'm gonna have to. Anyways. Just pour this baby all over it. Pour some on the inside and the rest all over it. Yeah. Ooh. 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 This feels good. Ooh. Ooh. I said this way. The season will marinate all in because it's tab up, so you know, season I go penetrate it and do its thing. Oh, you rub it in, rub it in, you rub it in, guys. I know I still don't like my oven, I know don't be like me pre to no oven, guys. But I'm a preview. We'll give the chicken time for the season to soak in it. Guys, y'all don't know what I didn't do. Should be mixing all of these all at once. Or I should have just blended it in. Blend it in the seasoning. That's what I should have done. It's okay, still can pop it like, like that. But blend it in a seasoning next time, guys. Blend it with the other seasonings next time. Next time, blend it all in, blend it all in, blend it all in. That's spicy. Give that spicy. See that guy? Maybe say pop some more of me in there. <laughs> Maybe that's what he's saying. Pop me in there. Pop more of me in there. I don't like the feeling of the onion powder on um, me. Just me. gonna be good like real good wow I like this I really do like it yep 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 so as I told you I pop this in the freezer now we're gonna pop it in this you could use rice stuff your chicken whatever you want to use and as I said you can use the color low if it's not cooked you could stuff it same way cook it if you want cook it if you you don't have to cook it if you don't want your choice, whatever you choose, guys. Mm. Look, I just stuff it in there. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
today. <laughs> you know I'm crazy. Look at juice running out. You crazy girl. When you cook it that way, you can eat the color low if you want to when it's big. When you don't cook it, it probably won't cook as tender as you want it. When you take it out the home, so you probably won't be able to eat it. So now, you could get um, a string and tie the legs together like this. If you cut off this part, but if you don't, you could just use that part and come up and bring it right. And bring it in like this, like this. It's giving me a problem. Guys, I really wanted a file to pop over it, you know. Oh, I can put a little piece of butter in it, guys. I'ma put a piece of butter in it. My fix, my really and truly fix. My file paper done. So guys, so guys, this is my first time taking it from the oven. So I'm gonna make the sauce now for this, guys. Pop this back in the oven, make the sauce, and pour all over it. Guys, the file paper isn't really necessary, but if I did have it, I'd put it over it, it will let it spring some water, you know, so it must stick or not, you know. But it's good, as y'all can see. Did you put butter in it because it looked like I did put butter in it? Guys, we're on to the sauce. We're making sauce. Oops, that's a lot of ketchup. Yeah, that's a lot of ketchup. A lot, a lot, a lot. Of, this is too much ketchup, guys. Oh, gosh. Did you see much ketchup? Why did I pour so many ketchup? Not using any browning, we're using the good old size sauce. That should do it, right? Oops, that's a lot. That's a lot, young girl. That's a lot. Guys, I changed my color. Now this looks like barbecue sauce. Well, the darker looking barbecue sauce. Guys, <laughs> y'all can see it. Hush. Hush, guys. See? See that? Ooh. And I'm messing up my clothes. But, ooh. Oh, where is wide awake again, guys? And he's making a lot of noise. Excuse my baby. Alright. I'm gonna add in here also. Is a little of our apple cider vinegar. Ooh, not too much, guys. And a little lime juice. Lime juice. I'm trying to give it a sweet and sour. A sweet and sour taste. Sweet and sour taste. We'll add a little honey. That's enough. And a little tubes of sugar. Mm, 
probably tip some salt in it too because I didn't put any salt on the chicken. I don't remember putting any salt on the chicken. Yes. Oh, the Maggi seasoning. Do it thing for me. Hey, 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 hey. Enough of you. So guys, that's what it looks like. Can I can see I'm thinking this needs some more water. A little bit more water. So let's taste this. Fresh. Guys, when I'm doing sweet and sour chicken, I really want to get that sweet and that sour taste. Some people cook sweet and sour chicken, and that sweet chicken, that's not sweet and sour chicken. Now look how sour and it's going to So I always try to achieve that sour taste and both sour and sweet taste. You understand? what I'm talking about. Let's try a little of the distilled vinegar also just a little. Guys I really want that little tanginess to it. <laughs> I really need that tanginess. Just a sweet taste and in a tangy taste also. What's wrong? What's wrong? Mm. Mm. There we go. So guys, basically what we're gonna do is pour this baby all over it. Ooh. Hey, leave that! Come here, baby. Berries, yeah. get your child. Get him. Hey, hey. Move from there, so poor here. Hey. 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 Yeah. Yeah, 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 Oh, I'm messing up the police, guys. Guys, I'm gonna make y'all see what it looks like, and then I pop it back in the oven, and then I take it out a second time, pour it all over it again, and then put it back in the oven, and then it will. So basically, that's what it's looking like now. So we're gonna pop it back in the oven for it to keep that color. Whoa, it's pretty. Y'all ain't getting the real color, guys. It's pretty, guys. There goes the finished product. This look darky. On the camera, it look real dark. So there you go. Yeah, I cut off one of the wing on the neck. And if you wanna test.
test your chicken if it's ready just stick it with a knife for a fork and as long as there is no water springing from it then it's good and yep that's my finished product so thank you guys for watching remember to like comment share and subscribe if you're new hit the notification bell beside the subscribe button and i'll see you all in my next video